Hey there, it's Elliot. You know, I've been getting a lot of questions recently like, Elliot, how do I get rid of this annoying iPhone lock to owner message? It can be a real pain, especially when you want to use your iPhone, iPad, or even Apple Watch. Now you've probably seen a bunch of software and services that promise to bypass this lock. Some of them might even work, but often they come with a hefty price tag, not to mention the security risks. But what if I told you there's a better, safer, and wait for it, free alternative? In today's video, we'll explore a few simple and legal tricks to help you navigate this issue. So, grab your device and let's get that pesky locked message out of your way once and for all. Stick around, this is going to be a real game changer. Just a heads up folks, we're sharing this info so those of you who actually own your device but have lost track of your login details can get back in. We're not here to help anyone sneak around security on devices they shouldn't have. Let's keep things legal and respectful, alright? Our video is totally in line with what YouTube expects from us. Okay, now that we've cleared that up, let's get back to it. Picture this, you've got an iPhone locked to the previous owner and you need help figuring out what to do. Well, don't worry, you're not alone. Lots of folks find themselves in the same boat. Now, one could search for many different methods online, but let's make it easier for you and save you some time. Enter Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, Lock to Owner, and iUnlock app. These are some of the best iCloud unlock service options out there for iPhones locked to their previous owners. To give you a bit of a backstory, the people behind these services have provided solutions for locked iPhones for years. They're not just about quick fixes, they're about creating reliable, efficient, and above all, safe unlocking methods for every iPhone user. Before you start worrying about how complicated these services might be, let's put your mind at ease. In the next step, we will walk you through how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. It's a breeze, honestly, so stay tuned and you'll be unlocking your iPhone in no time. For those of you tuning in from first world countries, it's important to note that the unlocking services we've discussed mainly operate in these regions. If you can't access them or would instead not utilize these services for any reason, we've got an exciting alternative for you. Every week we offer 250 unlocks to our loyal viewers for absolutely free. Yes, you heard that right, free. Now, you might be wondering how you can get in on this. It's easy. Just hit that like button. Ensure you're subscribed to our channel. This will qualify you for the unlock and keep you updated on our latest videos and offers. Comment your model, IMEI, and country, and that's it. You're automatically entered to win one of this week's 250 free unlocks as soon as you complete these steps. Please keep your eyes peeled for more opportunities in our future content. All right, let's dive right into the step-by-step -step process. All right, folks, let's dive right into these step-by-step -step instructions. Open your phone or computer browser and type in unlockhere.com. This nifty web app uses an AI assistant to help unlock mobile phone restrictions. Once the page loads, you'll meet Nifty, the AI bot. Click on Activation Lock to let Nifty know you need an iCloud unlock. This is where you'll also select your device. If you have an iPhone, click on iPhone, but you can also choose iPad or Apple Watch if those are the devices you want to unlock. Next, you need to enter your IMEI or serial number. If you're scratching your head right now thinking, what's the difference? Let me clarify. iPhones all have IMEI numbers. So if you're unlocking an iPhone, choose IMEI. However, some iPads and Apple Watches have IMEIs only if they have a SIM card slot or cellular capacity. If not, they come with a serial number instead. Finding this number is easy. Press the sleep button on your locked device again and tap on the I on the bottom right. Voila, you can now see your device info. Remember to input your device information in the next step. You'll also need to enter some basic info to attach the order to your account. Make sure it's real info as you'll receive a confirmation code in this email. Please check that you agree to the terms and are not planning to unlock a stolen device. Then, remember to solve the quick captcha. We need to make sure you're not a robot. Tap start process and get ready for the next step. Head over to your email inbox. You should have received an email with a confirmation code. Sometimes it sneaks into the spam or junk folder, so make sure to check there too. Take this confirmation code and head back over to the Unlock Here website. Enter the code and confirm once again that you're not a robot. Once you've done that, your unlock process will officially begin and your device will be unlocked. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone lock to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it'll be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again once it's finally unlocked. So it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. 
In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap, forget password, or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. Stick around because after this, another method might be just the one for you if this initial approach doesn't fit your needs. So don't go anywhere. Let's dive right into some more alternative ways to get around that iCloud activation lock without ending up on the wrong side of the law. Reach out to the original owner. Yes, sometimes the solution really is that simple. If you can find the previous owner, they should be able to remove the device from their iCloud account with a few quick taps. Use Apple support. If the above doesn't work or isn't an option, don't worry. You can contact Apple support directly. They'll need to verify that you're the rightful owner of the device, so get ready to answer some questions and possibly provide proof of purchase. Remember, these methods aren't about breaking or hacking anything. Those roads lead to trouble. I hope this guide helps you out if you're ever stuck with an iCloud activation lock. Remember, always keep your iCloud password and recovery info safe and secure to avoid these issues in the first place. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Happy unlocking.